Welcome to Utoxida for the Biddens Grand National. One miles, one full on handicap chase for you. El Central, Barbie, Winnie Jawad, Katie Holmes, Mad Cooper, Dark and Tribulation, James Shea, Marazinian, Darren Thompson, well done, Jeannie, Diary Lad, Over the Clover, Patrick Hogan, Earth Leader, John Morgan, Emily O, Patrick Hogan, Nash's winner, Ironical Owl, the Pontypool Racing, Greenock Islander, Matt Cooper, and the Burt Brandt, Alex Cherry Lemons in, and Nash's winner, it's been out of source all season, and now 12. Probably too long of the tooth. Uh, Hornicle Owl, but he won well last season. Beating John Morgan, trained with Tarquin. And John Morgan as the leader year in Earth Leader. Leads by about a length and a half, just two ones this season for Earth Leader. He had shifted his idle last time out. He was fifth before that, so he could be well handicapped. The number seven horse, he's well clear of Marzium for Down Thompson in second. They jumped in that one. They've all jumped that one safely in the Midlands Grand National. And they head towards the next. And Earth Leader is a couple of clear Marzium in second. Ironic Arald is close up in third. And up early for him, he usually comes off the pace when he wins. In four, four, the Clovers jumped into third past him. A little cap then to Bert Brand, and then comes Bolden Journey, Katie Holmes, El Centro Babi, Dark and Tribulation, and then Greenock Islander, and Emily O is the bat marker. Jump in the ditch, watching them going over it. They all jump that safely. And there'll be a wing counting for you in, in the next race bring you their Somerset National and then I'll be off to the final three races at Fakenham for you I jump in that one and her leader is a couple in clear of Mausoleum in second over the clover in third and then in fourth is Ironical Howald two lengths then to the well done Genie and David Ladd who's had a great week well done, Davey, on your big wins in the, in the Arc to Triumph. Katie Holmes Hopkins is on the outside. He's swinging in. Uh, I say, say that, I hope Davey hasn't watched the jumps first. <laughs> the flat second. I hope he's going on the, he got on watch the flat first. Sorry, Davey, if you haven't. I should have said nothing. Yeah, for God, you know, you do both codes like me. And we lost one El Central Pist, Barbie is gone, and shifted a rider. And the Winnie Jarrod interest in the race has gone. But Earth Leader is still clear. I think we were tackling for John Morgan, he led most of the way last season in this race. But then our right loud made ground and took it up in the straight and held on to win by a couple of lengths. From River Tarquin. They jump in that one. Our car, the, the worst horse in the Pontypool Racing Stable. Surprised everybody winning it last year. Must have been a really poor race. Earth Leader, three lengths clear of Over the Clover. Mazurian in third. A gap to Army on the ground. you think that I would be able to? Train a good stayer. Oh, they don't because I do have a few good stayers on the flat, but I, for some reason I can't not get a good staying horse in the national hunt. It might be because I'm breeding the flat and the stairs instead. I must switch my training around. Air leader, it's clear. Jumping, coming towards the next, and he jumps it well. Still. I saw the water so well over the circuit to run the course of plenty of time. Over the clover in second, Mazion in third, and Marazion, sorry, then Hyonical Howald. Behind these is Dark and the Tribulation and Katie Holmes. I wonder if I called that Katie Hopkins just now. I hope not. Well done, Jeannie. Emily O. Greenock Islander and Bertrand. If I did, 
that inside. Name me all those other than such a person. <laughs> uh, jump in that one. Katie Holmes, much better person, I suppose. And her leader is about four to five lengths clear of Over the Clover in second. Dark and Tribulation in third on the inside, Ironical Howells. And Katie Holmes, well done, Jeannie. Maui Leon, MDO. Greenock Islander and Burt Brand. So I feel these I've seen around in the Fox Centres, especially Greenock Islander and maybe Katie Holmes as well. They jump in that one. Even Burt Brand on the back. Earth Leader setting this good pace. In second place is Dark and Tribulation. James Shea. I had a nice one a couple of years ago, my museum has fallen. A very young nice one, I believe it was seven at the time, wasn't it? Uh, jump in the next, and Bert Brand is getting further behind now. He's only got a mile and a half as he head down the straight. And Earth Leader's jumping well today at the moment. Sorry if that's going to be a bit of a Jinx on it, uh, John. But he's jumping well. He, he must be well handicapped for this. He's two limbs clear of Dark and Tribulation. Might be even a Dark Horse for the National Earth Leader. That's the right name. Named after a very good horse indeed. No, was that Earth Summit? I don't know. I think there was one called Earth Leader as well. Earth Leader. Clear of Over the Clover, Katie Holmes, well done Jeannie, Dark and Tribulation, Emily, I are gone, Owl has dropped back through the field now, and there's been Guardian by Green Islander, and these are still about 8 inches clear of Burt Brand, still the back marker, we come up to the mile marker, and Earth Leader comes to this fence next one, and hits the water for the final time. He got towards the next, and if he's been closed on by Dark and Tribulation, right there is Over the Clover, the Irish Challenger, and then comes Katie Holmes, and then all the way from Scotland, well done, Jeannie, another Irish Hamlet, and the same ownership, same trainer, Emily O. I go towards the next. Dark and Tribulation, another Irish challenger, and there's two out in front now. Irish are well known for their Grand National horses. Uh, Dark and Tribulation and Over the Clover, a left clear of Earth Leader who jumped that better and gone back into second now. Behind these comes Well Done Jeannie, Kate Young, Sam Leo, Ironical Howell, Bert Brand has missed some very good ground, and Greenock Island is now just about marked with it swinging in. And five rounds, no, there's just four rounds left to run. And as they do, so Dark and Tribulation has gone to the front. Drone two limbs clear up Earth Leader in second. Back in third is Emily O. We had Emily O. Katie Home, Silver Club, Well Done, Genie, Ironical Howell, who made a mistake there. And now Bert Brandon has gone past him, and now Glenn has dropped right away. And now Dark and Tribulation's going well at the moment. He's two to three limbs clear of in second place, Earth Leader. Well, it's making good ground is Katie Holmes. They jump out and also making good ground now. Emily on the outside, and they go towards the second last. And it's Dark and Great Tribulation in the lead by an FNAC. Like Katie Holmes and Emily are both trying to close the countdown towards the second last. And they're all on the jumping, and a good jump of the leader. Be still only half length clear from Emily O in second. Then Katie Holmes and Earth Leader still trying to plug on. They go towards the final fence, and it's the Dark and Tribulation on the outside. Oh, come in between Mark Cooper and Katie Holmes but Dark Tribulation has his head in front up towards like Katie Holmes pulling on Sam Katie Holmes just going on close on to win by a length and a big win for Mark Cooper and Katie Holmes wins the Midlands Grand National and stay on well Grand National next is it Matt well done mate I won it well by a three quarters left with Dark in Tribulation in second MDO Back in third for Patrick Hogan. James A. Jess denied. 
Fourth for Weldon well Genie for David Ladd and fifth was Earth Leader for John Morgan. I'll see you down the weekend.